Hey everybody, this is Nemo, and in today's really quick tip, we will see how to recover an unrecoverable PrestaShop back office password. So you might have found yourself in this situation when you try to log into your back office and you can't for no reason suddenly and the password is okay you know it's okay but it's not working and whatever you do you sign in uh, it doesn't work you try recovering your password and you whether don't get the email or it doesn't work in any case what to do then well in today's quick tip we'll see how to do that manually so first off we should know how press the shop deals with password and uh, basically it's uh, an encryption method of the tools class uh, and as you can see, it's returning and storing into the database an MD5 hash of the cookie key constant plus your password. So basically, we need to replicate that pattern. Let's find out this uh, cookie key constant first. Well, it's located in your PrestaShop installation config settings.inc.php, and it's this one. So let's copy it. And now we need to generate the MD5 hash. Well, you can use any tool really, but uh, I just Googled and I found this one, which is pretty good. So I will paste this in and then any, any password you want. So like test password. I think it needs to be uh, at least four uh, chars long. So make sure it is. Then I will copy the hash and now we need to add it to the database. So I will log in to my PHP, my admin here, find out my employee in the uh, scroll down PS employee table, and then just replace. Save. And now let's try our uh, test password. Yep. We got access to our back office at last. And this method works for uh, PrestaShop 1.5 and above. I think it works with oh, 1.4 as well. Uh, so 0.4, 5, and 6 should work. Uh, 5 and 6 do work for sure. Now, as I last mentioned, uh, if you don't want to check the MD, uh, sorry, the um, cookie key every time, uh, you can try coding a small password generator like this one. So you access that uh, URL, passwordgen.php, uh, and pass in your password. Uh, it should be, again, more than a test password, more than uh, uh, four characters. But uh, uh, this way it works and it generates the, uh, the password, the real useful password uh, for you that you can then input into your database and replace the old one. Just make sure you erase this uh, file as soon as you use it because it's not exactly safe to keep it there. All right, that's everything. I hope you could uh, restore your back office password and access this way. As always, thanks for watching everyone. I will see you in the next video.